Lyle Eastman. We live here in Riceville, Iowa, Howard County. Uh, JKL Farms is kind of what we go by, I guess. Um, grew up in the construction world. We built this small cow calf to finish operation up just out of pure enjoyment of it. Uh, we started with a, with a daughter's bucket calf, took a Jersey bucket calf to the county fair. And from that point since, it's like, oh, this is kind of fun, it's something different, you know, I, being around the construction world, never grew up around the ag side of things, so we've, uh, we're, we started with a bucket calf, and pretty soon we're at a dozen cows, and then we're at 25, and, and now we average 50 plus is kind of where we like to hang around. That's enough. I work a daytime job off the farm. My wife's a school teacher and then I farm with my two brother-in-laws. We see the product from start to finish. Um, that's what's the great point about working with Upright with Beef is, is they're close. They'll work with the small, the small farmer operation, you know. Uh, being averaging 50 head, you, you barely have enough for a semi-load. And in order to, I think, accurately to send a semi-load somewhere, they need to be finished at the same time. Well. Working with Upriva beef, you can you can take a you can take a gooseneck load when they're ready, and then in two weeks when you, when some more get ready, you take another load over there. They're convenient. I can work with them with my work schedule. You know, just it's very accommodating. Um, every animal that I take to them, I would I would eat or feed to any of my family members. You, we couldn't have wrote a, a story better with an outcome where we're at. You know, we've only been here. A little over six years, Grandma moved to town and gave us the opportunity to, to raise our kids and, and live the farm life. Um, it's just kind of where we ended up. I wish, uh, I, I wish every, in a way, every kid could, could work and live on a farm for a couple of reasons. Uh, maybe one is, it's know where the food comes from. I think as time goes on, some kids are distant that where their food supply comes from and some of them just get to feel that it's from the grocery store. Um, and the other thing is, is responsibility. Each one of my kids has chores, they had fair projects, they've had responsibility. Are they perfect? No. There's days they didn't do their chores, there's days you gotta remind them to do their chores, there's days that it was downpour and rain that I would do their chores for them to help them out. But it just, it just gives a whole different view and respect on life. In a quick brief of my life, I guess that's where I ended up. I, what, what, could I ever wrote a book to, to tell me that we would have been here at this stage in our life? Absolutely not. I guess it just it just happened. It just it just truly happened.